Today I'm going to talk about thumbnail and what it really is. Yo, it's a boy Viper Shady back again with another video. What or, is thumbnail? Or is it a nail of a thumb like the picture shown here? A lot of people don't know about thumbnail. Uh, we tend to upload video in YouTube, social media or any kind of, you know, social networks but the thing is that we don't know what thumbnail is even i didn't know about it today i'm gonna break it down what really a thumbnail is okay a thumbnail is basically a banner that will help us to know what is inside the video and next thing is that i will also be helping you guys with how to make a simple and effective thumbnail from phone just from mobile phone and all you need is one application that is PixArt and I will be giving you that application in the description below so please check in so without further ado let's get into the video before that don't forget to subscribe let's make a thumbnail download this app from play store or click on the link given below in the description so install that app and open it and don't forget to turn on your data because you'll need it so after turning on your data click allow and you need to go down and you know select a background okay so let me select this white one and after this you need to make sure that your background is 16 to 9 ratio background so i'm clicking on crop and again there is a crop option i'm clicking there and i want to select 16 to 9 ratio or i can directly select that youtube okay that is small option the last one and let me take it so after this i want to add make thumbnail out here but i want to add a sticker of white studio so let me click on the stick sticker okay there and let me search yt studio y I'm a slow typer, you know, I type really slow. Slow in studio means that is, you know that, right? So I've typed in YT Studio. Let me select that YT Studio logo and it's not getting selected. Okay, it's it got selected. Let me place it to a suitable site. Okay, let me place it right here. And again, I want to add another sticker. Okay, and so I'm clicking on sticker again. So I'll search holding phone because i want to put a mobile phone there okay so i'm typing holding phone I'm typing holding phone oh it's not working because i made the spelling error so make sure that whatever you type here your spelling should be correct holding h-o-l-d-i-n-g phone okay now it will show see that holding phone okay now i got the options i have many phones so I can any of, I can add any of this sticker. See here, many, many, many. I'm going up and I, I selected this one. So I want to resize this and make it in a perfect size and place it to its perfect place, not everywhere. Arrangement is very important. So I'm placing it right here. And now what I want to do is inside this mobile phone, I want to uh, add a YouTube icon so I'm clicking on stickers again I want to add a YouTube icons inside this mobile phone right here so I'm clicking on the sticker and I want to search YouTube logo I want to add a YouTube logo or icon whatever you say it you know logo or icon it's same okay so okay I found many logos many icons let me select this middle one and resize it resize that logo in a suitable size and put it inside that mobile phone let me do that okay so mm -hmm. yeah this is the good size i think so i have resized it to a perfect size and let me again click on the sticker and i want to put the wording you know y o u t u b youtube i want to put that wording okay i'm searching it Mm -hmm. yeah i found it right there youtube okay i'm downloading it and let me resize it and put it inside 
Okay, I've done it. Now what's next? Now I want to write something. Okay, I want to write something. So I, let me click on text and let me type in YT Studio because that logo that I first put was YT Studio logo. Okay, so I'm typing in YT Studio logo and I let me place this right there right there let me change the color there's option and there's a front changing front option highlight there are many options okay so let me change the perfect suitable front that i want to keep i think this is good okay i'm searching which one is the best i'm a little bit puzzled about selecting the front let me select the perfect one i think this is the best one i guess it looks big and what I want next to do is that I want to click on add photos because I want to add half of the background and make it black. So I'm cl clicking on background and let me select a background. I want to keep black background. Okay, so I'm clicking on that black dot and just click on add and let me crop this background so that it will fit perfectly the half of this uh, screen. Okay this logo I want to keep it perfectly half of this logo covered with black so I'm cropping it you can see how I'm doing it from that bar okay you can select down you can explore later on because you will learn more when you experience yourself so let me resize it and uh, let me add text to it so what text am I going to type now I'm clicking on text again what am I going to type? How? I've typed how? I'm doing everything live, okay? So that's why I'm making mistakes while speaking as well because I am making this video in one take. Just in one take, okay? I'm not doing this cut and click, you know? I'm making exactly this in one take. So I'm typing in how to add thumbnails. How to add thumbnails from? Where? Mobile? And I put in that sticker. Let's see how it looks. Okay, let me place it on the best side. I think it, it doesn't look good. I didn't like it. Let me edit it a little bit. Okay. Let me put that thing down. Oh, it's not that good. Let me put that thing down, mobile. Okay, I think this is how it should look like. Now, after this, I think I should add a arrow. I want to add one arrow, okay? Not I'm not in archery field but we should add an arrow right there so let me click on sticker again sticker is the best option here so let me search arrow please don't make the spelling error okay it will not appear then if you make errors so type arrow a r r o w arrow okay, let me find there are many arrows let me find the best red color arrow I love red okay this is my favorite arrow okay let me put my favorite arrow i think i should place it a little bit up you know you should do it like this okay so you can just click on the right side of your photo and there's one tick side so you can tick there and i think your you know logo is and thumbnail is ready this is how you make a thumbnail from pixart so you can try this and you will know how to do it so click there and save it okay can you see that save option saved your photo in gallery so i think my thumbnail is ready this is how you will make it